Here we are, girls. Our new place. Can we check it out? Go right ahead, girls. After all, it is ours. Hello, we'd like to come inside. Louie, you don't have to knock. Just go right inside. So, what do you girls think of the new house? The house looks hungry. Hungry? What do you mean by that, Bingo? Its tummy looks empty. See, where's all the stuff? Bingo, you're right. This house is hungry. And you can help fill it up by helping us unpack some of the stuff we brought in the car. Girls? Girls? Bluey, you can't find me. You can't find me. Yes, I can. Now it's my turn to hide. Hee <laughs> hee. Bandit, I do believe the unpacking is up to us. Oh, I tried. Now, where is Bluey? Bingo will never find me over here. Well, maybe unpacking will go much faster without the girls distracting us anyhow. Oh, I couldn't agree more. We'll get this knocked out in no time. Here we are with this love seat. And two love seats. One for each of us lovebirds. And I've got the girls' bedside table. And this lamp. Looking good so far. And I got the kitchen cabinets. I can't believe we had to bring our own. Dad, did you pack our toys? Sure did, love. They're in the car. Oh, thanks. Come on, Bingo. Help me look. Toys! Be careful, girls. There's still a lot of stuff in there. Look, Bingo. I found the magic xylophone. Magic xylophone? The magic xylophone? Dear, I thought you said you packed that at the bottom. I did. It must have been your driving that jostled it up to the top. Duh. Dad, let's play with the magic xylophone. Girls, I don't have time to play the magic xylophone right now. I've still got a lot of stuff to do. And freeze. I'm sure we can play it later. Bandit? Bandit? Well, I guess I'll let you guys have your fun. Do you know what this house needs, Bingo? What, Bluey? A garden gnome. Ooh, I know. Ta-da! A new garden gnome! Great job, Bingo. I think we just need to move it right here. Now our front yard looks much nicer. Maybe you girls should think about unfreezing Dad so I don't have to do all the unpacking myself. Oh, alright. Unfreeze! Phew! Did you girls turn me into a garden gnome? Huh! I never! Here's where we'll put the coffee table. Bandit, anytime you're done playing and ready to pitch in, it would be nice. I'm coming, love. And heavy. It already was heavy. Bluey, can you help your father out a bit? Oh, all right. And heavy. Yeah. Daddy, I said unheavy. I'm trying. All right, almost there. There you have it, one unheavy refrigerator. Are you sure it should go on that side of the kitchen? Yes, I'm sure. Mum, Dad, can you unpack our beds next? Beds? Is it more than one? Yes, Bandit. The girls are getting big. I figured they could sleep in their own beds from now on. Well, I didn't know about that. Don't worry, I'll get one of them. Ugh, I knew we should have hired movers. Here you are, Bluey. Your bed has a capital B for Bluey. And here's your bed, Bingo, with a lowercase b for Bingo. But I want a capital B like Bluey. Don't worry, Bingo. When you're six like your sister, your bed will have a capital B too. But then what kind of B will my bed have? Well, then your bed will have a cursive B, of course. Dad, what's cursive? Oh, it's a way of handwriting that adults use to show how bad their handwriting is. Bandit, that's not true. Don't tell them that. Oh, I've seen your signature. It's true. All right, girls, we still got a lot to do. So how about you girls get playing? Okay, Dad. Come on, Bingo, let's play. Now to see what else we can find in the car. Okay, Bluey. Look, there's a balloon. Oh, yay! All right, here we are then with our bathtub. Looking very nice, I must say. Here we go with the toilet beside it. There. Now they just hook them up. 
Are you sure you know how to plumb these? Yes, why? <laughs> well, maybe you should do the toilet. Don't let it touch the ground, Bingo. I won't. Hey, girls, what are you playing? We're playing Keepy Uppy with a balloon. <coughs> we have to keep it off the ground, but it's kind of easy. Oh, I can fix that. <sighs> <laughs> oh no, that was our only balloon. Girls, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. What seems to be the trouble, girls? I think I made the game too hard. But don't worry, I'll get another balloon in the morning. I think we have one more balloon we can use. No, only packed the one. That was it. No, we have one more. I'm not quite sure what you're getting at there. This is a good idea, Mummy. I have to disagree. Alright girls, stop blowing. <gasps> Look at Daddy go! Daddy, you make such a great balloon. Alright girls, I think I've worked out for my guilt now. Time to get back moving. Aw oh, man! Daddy, you're no fun. Here you girls go, it's your kiwi rug. And your tent, so you can play doctor. Oh yeah, good thinking, love. I'll just be in here, uh, making sure the telly works. I'm sure the TV works fine. Now get your feet off the coffee table and help me with these stools. Oh, right on it, love, right on it. Oh, hey, girls. Daddy, we need a patient. Oh, all right, real quick then. We need a girl patient. Okay, well, um, ask your mum. Mum's too busy. You'll have to be our girl patient. Oh, all right. I mean... All right, my name's Bandina, and I believe I've had too much Vegemite to eat. Dad, I mean Miss Bandina. Girls wear makeup. Not all girls. I mean, not all girls. Bandina does. All right, if you must. Um, is it too late to change my mind? Daddy, you're Bandina. Now go ahead and lay down so we can check you out. All right, all right. Good, now I need to listen to your heart. That's my tummy, love. But I hear it in there. <gasps> Bluey, what does that mean? Yes, what does that mean? It means, Daddy, I, I mean, Bandina, you're having a baby. Cheese and crackers. Please remain calm, ma'am. This is quite natural. I'm not so sure that it is. Congratulations, Bandina! I prescribe no more work for the rest of the day. You need to relax. Oh, well, if you say so, I'll go relax in front of the TV in the living room. Wow, I can't believe Bandina's having a baby. Yeah, I just thought she was eating too much. I heard that! Bandit, I thought you were supposed to help me with these stools. Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm Bandina, and I'm having a baby. No work for me, though. <laughs> Girls, can you come here for a minute? What is it, Mum? I believe Bandina's been misdiagnosed. Misdiagnosed? How? Well, you see how the tummy bolt is here, 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 and all that over there? Oh, yes, we noticed that right away. Yes, well, this belly is not filled with a baby. It's filled with chips. Yeah, but how did our belly get so full? I believe I've seen Miss Bandina sneak off with some chips whenever you look away from your plates. No, sir, ma'am! How very dare you! I couldn't agree more, but there is a cure. More exercise. Very well. Miss Bandina, back to work. All right, all right. But can I at least wash out the makeup? No, you may not. <sighs> there, I got the stool, just like I said I would. And I've got the very last thing from the car. The microwave. Mum, Dad, are we going to move again tomorrow? That was fun. No, no, love. We're going to stay here for quite a while. Yeah, because now this house is full. You're right, Bingo. This house is full. And he'll make a great home for us. Now, can I go wash off this makeup? Of course you can, Miss Bandina. <laughs>